Hello everybody, it is Classic Gamer here and welcome back to another video. So we're going to be picking up where we left off in the last video and we're going to talk to James. Oh no, not again. Hi Ren. Why am I sewing almost all of the clothes I have in stock to sew to the tourist hero all sold out? I guess that's pretty nice. I guess it's a pretty nice problem to have since it means I've sold lots of stuff, but it's still a problem. Before now, I've always been, I've always, I'm always, I've, oh. <coughs> Before now, I've always been able to order new clothes and have them delivered from New York City, but lately it's not been going very well. All the package of clothes seem to be getting lost. Taking care of course if I went there. Yeah, you heard right. The mall, you have a top shopping destination. Hey, maybe you could help me out and pick up my packages. There's only one small catch. They don't let horses in Norfolk City. I think you could give Coco down a break and head to the Norfolk City Mall for me. Why do I feel like? I think I did it on like a different account. You'll go amazing. Thanks, Ryan. You'll probably also pick the horse gear. You'll also, also pick up the horse gear as well, you know, since you're there. How do you get to your big city mall? It's easy. All you have to do is take the bus. What are you waiting for? You've got a bus to catch. Okay. I'm having literal deja vu because I was questing for one of my friends. Do not give your username a password out, guys. That's not a good idea. But I was questing for one of my friends and I did this quest for them and I'm having deja vu. I'm gonna claim the travels a token. Hey, Ren, there's something I wanna talk to you about. Something serious. It's not a scam. Have you heard of the heard of traveling toilet pictures? It's where you take a toy like a plushie or an action figure and post it in photos. This is Token, he's a dragon. I've had him for as long as I can remember. You know those postcard photos you helped me with before? I was thinking, would it be a lot more fun if you post a token in them? What if I let you borrow a token to take along as you explore the area? That sounds so cute. You do? Then you'll do it awesome. To make this work, I need enough shots to fill an album with postcards. I trust you to find the best shops, OPS, in the area, options in the area. Just to make sure Token looks good in the shots, bring them back when you've completed the album, and I promise to make it worth your while. Take good care of Token now, I promise you will make, I trust you, you will make him look like the majestic dragon he is. Oh, I didn't read that last one. I'm not gonna claim <laughs> any of the token things right now. Because I don't have half of the things unlocked for a token. Um, but let's go to the mall now. <laughs> I don't have half of the areas for a token, and even then I let it sit for so long on my main. But when I do do token, I'll do a video with like all the token locations. So I'm not gonna claim them yet until I get all the areas. Just because. City Mall. It's a multi Oh man. Alright. Um is there a place where I can claim? Oh, I don't have any ongoing. I guess there's a. What are these? <gasps> Mysterious Beastwalker. Oh my gosh, but you see all these. <laughs> there's so many ghosts. Oh man. Alright, I guess we're going back to this guy. Well, well, what can I do for you? And you're picking up stuff for James and Fortnite. You say, ha, ah, well, you certainly not the first victim he sent to do his work for him. All because he's too stingy to buy his own bus ticket. Stingy to buy his own bus ticket. He sends other people here to run his errands. Exactly, it's me. But now I've had enough. I can't be bothered to help you as well as all the others. You'll be looked for after yourself. Okay, since you look as so nicely, you can help me with something in the return though first. You'll be happy to help you say, well that's great. Maybe you're not as blah blah blah. Not as bad as the other people. 
you can see, the floor here is completely spotless and not a bad job if I do say so myself. Sadly, people just walk all over it any which way they please and they're going to put a stop to that. They act like they own the place, but they never show any respect for my hard work. Your place warning signs around here are just mobbed and maybe the floor will be, will be able to stand up for the fifth floor. Go on, get out of here. Put the signs up and don't come back. <laughs> don't come back before. Sorry, I'm like, my eyes like oh, can't focus on. <laughs> my eyes are not focusing on those. Hi, me. I'm trying to. Um. Um. Why am I so close? I was trying to look behind. Oh goodness. Only star stable. I'm gonna be honest, these uh, these quests were never my favorite. That's why I'm kinda like skipping through them a little bit. Rest in peace, Raptor. Okay. Yeah, yeah. That's not so dumb. Maybe there's hope for you yet. Kids these days. Always making a mess. No respect for their elders. Eh, do you need anything? I'm too busy to chat. This mall is a mess. I need to clean it up. If you help me tidy to the mall, I can talk. Okay. Only because... These quests don't give much XP, which kind of stink, but whatever. Why am I? I'm so close to my character. What the heck? Oh, that's why. Why am I so close? Oh my gosh. A smidge closer. Gee. Oh, I'm stuck. Um, I'm stuck. Help. Help. Send help, guys. Help. <sighs> um. Guys, I'm stuck. What do I do about this? <laughs> I was just trying to fix. Wait, maybe if I. No, I don't. Um. <laughs> okay, um, I'll be back. Alright, we're back when we left off. Really praying and hoping they're not even moving. Um. Let's hope I don't get stuck this time. I'm kind of scared. Please don't break. Oh, please don't break. This is my only way up here. Oh, thank gosh. So I had to completely relog. It would not fix itself. That was terrifying. stuff I won't be able to get until like level 12 which really sucks but trust me the second I get to a higher level we are doing the biggest shopping spree on here or like after I max those two horses okay don't click anything yet because <laughs> last time it broke okay I do want to see There is some cute stuff I can get actually. That's surprising. Well, when we get to the max showings, I'll get stuff, some stuff. 
things. What seems to be the problem? Well, you surely know how James works. Last time he was here, he tried to get me to buy buy into a joint membership of an apartment in one of the towers of Portland. It wasn't even built and didn't have planning permission, but he still tried to get me to put down a deposit that was enough money to buy half of Valedale. I seem to remember letting him know exactly what I thought of him at the time. He has a he, he must have run all the way back to Fort Penta faster and bolted than a bolted horse. Since then, he's never dared show his face around here. James orders clothes from Gordon and the, at the clothing store over there. Talk to Gordon. Come back to me with, with the clothes deliver, clothing delivery once you've got it. No point in carrying around a huge heavy pile of clothes. So James paid you pick up horse. I'm just gonna pick him up at the same time, that's what I'm doing. Right, he must have ordered it from Alex. She's the owner of the horse equipment store here at Yoga City Mall. Go talk to her. See, this is great. I don't understand why they wanted us to bring it back to him. Hello, welcome to Yoga City Mall. I mean, Yoga City Mall clothing store. The biggest clothing store here in Yorkic. If you want to try all our fabulous outfits, all you need to do is go into the fitting room over there and check out our collections. Clothing over for James. Oh, right. I thought you wanted to buy something. Oh, well. Now, let's see. Exactly. James' order. I have it in stock. Wait a second. I'll grab it for you. I love the door to the stock room every evening. I always have the keys in my backpack since I'm forever losing little things like keys and coins. So the backpack helps me remember where everything is. Hold on, I'll just grab it. Where's my backpack? No, I must have left it somewhere. Oh no, this means I can't get into the stockroom. Would you be able to help me? In the end, he, uh, he ends up freaking um, having it. He forgot to lock it, if I remember right. So it doesn't even matter that we're gonna go get his backpack. Unless they change the quest. Wouldn't surprise me if they did. They like to do that. Okay, let's find. I'm going this way. Oh, there it is. Dun, dun, dun. Pooper scooper. I'm gonna tell you didn't even need the backpack. Amazing, you found my backpack. You'll never guess what happened while you were away. I'd forgotten to lock the door to the stalker, so I didn't need the key in my backpack in the end. Seems like forgetting the stock the stock room was pretty lucky. In the end, I found time to pick out items and changes order while you were out looking for my backpack. Here, who was supposed to be the order? Who was supposed to get the order again? James, of course, that's how it was. Are you sure you don't need to go to the mall janitor first? Everyone else who's who James sends seems to go to him, and I understand why. This order must weigh half a ton. It goes right in our backpack. I'm not going to you yet, janitor. Let me grab the clothes. I mean, the horse gear. Welcome to Yorvik's biggest horse equipment store. How can I help you? Equipment for James. Oh, you're here to pick up his order? That's a shame. I thought I'd do James a favor, so I sent his delivery off on its way. It's only been a couple of minutes, though, so you're lucky. Don't look- you don't look happy. You won't have to carry it anymore. Cheer up. Haha, <laughs> you're strange. Why do you want loads of work if you can get away with not doing it? You promised him? Okay, okay. If you hurry, you must catch up with JB before he leaves off the mall. He's JB, he's the driver who takes all deliveries to Silver Guide. He usually stops for a cup of coffee before he gets on the road of his truck. See you come back soon. Ooh. Can I climb that? No, it's too far. 
<sighs> Hello, janitor. Stop, hold it one second. Back up, back up. Let JB drink his coffee. Shh. This isn't coffee, this is tea. Everyone, calm down. JB's here. Take it away. You know what? What old JB would say when this kind of thing happens? What? You don't know who JB is? I'm JB. What's your name? Lynn? Hmm. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. I've got my job. I've got a job for you. Get me some tea with milk. Don't forget the tea. Okay. We used to have to buy it. Ah, coffee. Ha. Now I'm ready. Time to get out on the open road again. Keep the home fires burning and I'm not back in sunrise. Call the councilman. What now? A delivery for James, you ask? Of course. It's right here beside me. You can trust old JB. My deliveries always get where they're going door to door. Last month I managed to drive off the bridge of Fort Benta three times. Three. That's a new record. You can only tell James JB's on the way. You'll take the orders, James, you say? Oh, okay. Let's work for me, I suppose. Take it. Uh, thank you. <coughs> uh, the customers that order from the cafe don't just sit nicely at their tables. Instead, I, they wander off around the mall with my cups and saucers. Let's start gathering up all the dishes. Thanks so much. Okay. Hold on, JB. I mean... Janitor, I want to finish the quest here while I'm here. Cause, yeah. Just makes it. Ew! Hello, person. Oh god, they're level 23. They're the same level as my main. <laughs> give, me, give me the plate. Give me the plate. Give me the plate. Give me the plate. Give me the plate! Oh, she's following me. Hi. Why are you following me? <laughs> it's kind of funny. There's five. Uh, I need one more. Darn. How's it going down here? Yeah, the same takes forever. Remember when you could run up it and it wouldn't take this long? I miss those days. I'm just gonna grab the one from in here. Number six. Okay. Hold on, janitor. I'm doing other quests. Great, you found all the dishes that disappeared from the cafe. Thanks a lot. Alright, you're welcome. Goodbye. Yeesh. Okay, so he's carrying the clothes. There we go. So there we go. Now you've got both of the deliveries, James one. And come back to the mall tomorrow if you want, but wipe your feet on the way in. I don't want more dirty feet tramping over my nice clean floors. I hope you get something from James for all the trouble you've got into. Not likely, but now you've got yourself a bus ticket, you'll be able to come here whenever you like. See you soon. Uh, finally done with the mall. I, I love the mall, but oh my gosh. There's like so many quests. <sighs> we have so much to do and so little time. I might try to get to level 10 today. Not in this video, but in general. Oh wait, I could probably do that. Boop. Ooh, I'm getting lag spikes. It's just fantabulous. I ran how to go. Wonderful. Both clothes and horse equipment. These are going to sell my hotcakes. Reward. I promise you a reward. Seems like you remembered wrong. Okay, okay, I have something. Hold on, let me see. I've got this box. 
Here, isn't this a nice present? You'll like it. Now, if you'll excuse me, I've got business to attend to. Just stealing James's merchandise. It's fine. <laughs> it's, it's fine. He doesn't need it. Okay, let's see what else we have here. What's this? Penny and Polly. Hi, are you here to inquire about our upcoming pony race? So you're Ren, nice to meet you. I'm Polly and this is my sister Penny. We are, dare I say, the biggest pony fans in Yorvik. That's right, ponies make up for their small size with their huge personalities. And here in Yorvik, even the smallest ponies are just as fast as larger racing horses. They're cheaper to keep too. I swear, Poker, my Dartmoor pony gains a pound just by looking at grass. And my Gotland Pony Joker is not only super cuddly, he is also just the right height for me to spend hours brushing and braiding his mane. So, also, are you a pony fan? I love all horses equally. Yes, one of us. Penny, can you pitch our new race, our new course? Oh, yes, of course. We're just about to set up a new race only for ponies, just outside of Fort Penta. You should tag along. We let everybody try the race once, no matter what horse they have. Dude, that is different. When this race first came out, you had to have a pony. And it the quest just literally didn't go away. <laughs> We're here to meet James today. We placed an order with him ages ago for some obstacles for our race. The package really should have gone here by now. He has been avoiding us all day, and I don't know why. I can talk to James for you. That's so nice of you, thank you. Okay, James! Oh man. This game just really wants me to buy a pony. Whatever do you want, I'm busy. Oh wait, it's you, Ren. So what business do you have here today? Do you have a delivery for Penny and Polly? The Bona Girls, Ren, surely you understand how bad it is for my business to let Taurus leave before Benta. If you people, the people start try, going to try out that pony pony merry-go-round, there are less people to spend money on merchandise. Can't you make a business out of it? Wait, aha, uh -huh, I'm a teacher's friend. Take my camera, quick, go take some photos of their ponies. <sighs> Why can't you do this yourself, bro? Who doesn't do crap? And like I didn't even they didn't I didn't even ask permission, like Like they're just standing there probably wondering why I'm taking pictures of their horses that isn't even mine. I do love the Dartmoor so very cute. Uh, sorry guys, how to take pictures. Oh, excuse me. Ah, uh -huh, look at this. You're not bad of you're not bad of a photographer, you know. Maybe you can even get paid for your photos. Not on my account, of course. Alright, so while you were photographing, I went out of my way to order for <coughs> to deliver the order for the Pony Girls for free. Why do you look at me like that? Do you think I'm cheap? You know, I have a heart of pure shiny gold. I wonder what heart of gold would be worth. What would it cost to replace it with a cheaper pacemaker, you think? Psh, never mind that. You can give the girls a delivery is on the way. Okay. Oh my goodness. Looks like you had more luck with James than we did. So he really sent the order, that's awesome. I can't believe it, we finally are ready to set up our rates. You should be the first one to try it since you managed to persuade James to deliver our order. Polly and I have a couple of errands to run, but we'll go to Pony Point as soon as we can. That's where we will set up the race. I'll mark it on your map. We'll see you there. Okay, I was hoping. Okay, we're. I was about to say we're almost done with races at Fort Penta, but we have actually quite a few more. Cause there's some over here at Doyle's and the one I need a pony for. So I probably won't do that one today because I don't want to buy a pony today. <laughs> Sorry. Not that I don't love ponies, but... Hmm. 
Oh man. This horse is, feels slow, but I know it's just because it's low level. I really need to start training it. Well, I did start. I need to like actually continue training it. to ride with a fishing boat so we gotta get faster than we expected all right so here are the obstacles they don't look brand new do they as long as they're good for jumping over i guess they're heavy though right if you carry the obstacles um making me do everything bro that's what they do in this game they use you oh gosh and it's gonna stop me every time of course it is, because why wouldn't it? I want to finish Fort Pinto today. So I don't have to do any more quests here. But it, something tells me that's not gonna happen. Ooh. Oh my gosh, of course I ran past it. Uh, looking. Alright, let's go back. You're done, perfect, thank you so much. Now we're ready for our very first test ride, aren't we, Polly? Oh my, this is so exciting. Is this your best first ever pony exclusive race? Not to scare you off or anything, Grant. Of course you're gonna enter without any with any horse three choices once. I can't wait to hear what you thought of the race. And if I remember right, something breaks, which is why we don't get horse XP for this, because they're greedy, star safe is greedy like that. I'm kidding. That was a joke, Star Stable. Please don't, please don't ban me. <laughs> Apart by a gust of wind, bro. <laughs> Imagine. Holy drone, did you guys see that? The obstacle just fell apart. We can't host a race with obstacles I can't even hold together. I can't believe this. It looks like the obstacles are entirely rusted. We didn't see it at first because they were already assembled. And look, some of them look like they just got hit by something. You know, it doesn't escape me that a certain someone delivered these for us, already assembled for free. Wait, is that... Hi, James. God, I mean, hey, hi. It was awful nice for you to deliver these obstacles for us, you know, assembled and all. Hey, yeah, that's me, Mr. Nice Guy, and all that. Then you wouldn't happen to know why they're all rusty and broken. Broken? Me? Hey. I couldn't imagine how that happened. It's not like the box that came and got pushed over a cliff or something. Absolutely not. Especially not twice. So why are you here then? As a minister of tourism in Fort Pinta, it is my duty to make sure you're you lot trying to steal my business, your business, James. We want people who love Pony to come visit us. The more people who come from the rest of Europe to visit us, the more people might even visit you. You could even join us and gain more tourism from helping us with your the marketing. And you can try our race. Isn't Mr. Peanut basically your pony anyway? Excuse me, Mayor Peanut is a very esteemed mayor of. Wait up. Did you say more people might show up? Why didn't you say that from the start? Pony people, welcome to Fort Benta. Imagine how much money. I, I mean, we will, we will earn from this. 
It is very unfortunate that the obstacle seems to be in bad condition. That's bad for my business. Not sure, not to worry. I'll fix it up for you. Okay. See, there we are. Goodness me, I need to run, run. Okay, bye. Get out. Goodness me, you really did a good job mending up the obstacles. I've heard his sister, Alex, is... Wait. Oh my gosh, I forgot his sister was Alex. His sister, Alex, is really crafty. He must have learned a thing or two from her. But never mind that, now you can finally try out the race again. I think I'm losing my voice. I'm so excited, aren't you, Penny? Remember, and this is this is the one time you'll be able to ride the race with any horse. We need to be able to keep our promise of promoting bonus in the future. Of course. I'm just glad it's not what it used to be where you did all these quests and then in the end you weren't able to do the race because you didn't have a pony. I miss those days Success, beautifully ridden Ren. Thank you for all your help, and you're very welcome to come back anytime as long as you're riding a pony. Uh, that's finally done. Oh my gosh, it's like for Pinto just like exploded with things to do. This is actually insane. Oh my gosh. <clears throat> I think I could. I'm gonna do a few more days. Wait, why did I? Oh, my screen was black. I'm like, <laughs> was I not recording any of that? Um, I'm gonna do a few more quests because a lot of it's gonna be sped up. Oh my gosh, I think I'm like losing my voice. This isn't. This isn't fun. Okay. I was really hoping to finish Fort Pinto today, but these quests are taking like forever. These quests are long and don't give a good XP. That's a horse down there, I'm not too, too worried about that. Let's see what's this one. This one I think is you. This one I think is really quick though. Hi. Hi there, are you looking for a bag? Then you've come to the right place. We're for a Penta. For Penta Pet and Bag Store, we sell both pets and bags. I sell the best bags in all of Yorvik, my friend here behind me with all Penta Pets. Hey, you know what? Go over and say hi. Tell her I sent you as a VIP customer. Hello, hello. Aha, uh -huh, you're a VIP customer. Here you go. This is a saddle bag for your pet. It is the most beautiful bag in the world, but my colleague here has some really nice models if you want to try something more exclusive. But for now, for the pets, aren't they cute? They're all waiting for a new friend to take care of them. I want that. Are there any that you like? Come talk to me if you want to buy any of them. Do a look. Oh, they only have the, like, really expensive ones. Guys, should I buy a pet? <laughs> Maybe I'll come back. Maybe I'll come back. Okay, that's done. Oh, my horse. Okay, one done. I think there's only two more here in like actual Fort Penta that we can do. And then I have to do the ones like outside of Fort Penta. Oh, wait, no, there's three. There's three. My bad. And then I'll end this video because we'll finally be done with Fort Penta. 
there's some friendly competition going on here, everyone. Yeah, free money. Sorry, I'm just skipping this one because this is one of the newer quests that everybody kind of knows. So it's not like changed or anything. How many do I have to do? Okay, Jesus. That was rad, thanks. Okay, bye. <laughs> Um, I don't know what the heck is making that sound, but I'm out of here. Let's go over to whatever this is over here. Okay, that is not going away. I don't know what that noise is, but it's bothering me. Oh, it's a seagull lady. I see you ride a horse. Do you like horses? Then I just know you will love seagulls. How seagulls are adventurous creatures. You can pretty much do everything, just like feeling like just like the feeling you have when you bond with your horse. If you're having doubts about the seagull and want to make a good pet? Normally, yeah, but you might be right. But these seagulls that I have rescued from GED oil spills that are all looking for a good home are you the home. Aww. Take a good look. There's plenty of seagulls. So seagull pets. See, now I'm unlocking all the pets. I don't... <laughs> it's making me want the pets. I don't know what that noise is. Oh my god. It's actually driving me insane. I hate it. Okay, there's one more thing I have to do in Fort Pinta, and that's the bee trees. And then we can finally move up to Doyle's. Oh my gosh, this is great. And then I might take a break from recording and do my races. Cowabunga, dude. Just kidding. I'm not a surfer, but I do love this beach, and I want you to try this awesome race. Ah. Uh, <laughs> After I'm done with this, I'm definitely gonna try and like level up this horse a little bit. Take a break from recording. Probably eat something. Whee. Excuse me. Again, I don't know what that noise is, and it won't go. It won't go away. So hopefully it's not too loud on your guys' end, or like hopefully like my music's covering it up. Cause that's like, oh my god. I like this race. This race is really relaxing. It might be the boat. <laughs> I'm not sure what it is. covered in sand. Did you leave any on the beach? Ha! Huh. I hope you again. Hope to see you again soon. Alright. So there's that. And now all of Fort Pinta's done. Yay! Well, thank you guys so, so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!